and welcome to the Dr. Dazza channel. Today, I am wearing the same shirt I wore last video. Better. Today, I'm here with my wife, Kira. Hi. And we're going to be trying weird Japanese alcohol for summer. It is very hot here in summer in Japan, very humid, as you can probably tell from my hair, it's really annoying, but hey, that's one of the uh, perks of living in this country. And another one of those perks is that they have weird Japanese drinks that come out in summer. Mm. So we thought we would try 12 of them today and see what they're like. It is one of the most important thing. You have to always drink responsibly. So we've got some croquets and some karage because it is a kind of food. Yeah. It's what you eat when you drink. Japanese alcohol. And you also have some palate cleansers, one being the kitted in lemon and Hokari sweat. The idea of this is that we're going to be pulling them out randomly. We've got 12 vastly different drinks. See what they look like, see what they taste like, and then put them in each of our corners. And then if we both like them, we'll share them and we'll halve it and drink the rest later at the end. Or if only one of us likes it, we have to drink the rest of the thing. But if none of us like it, we both again have to drink it. It's only fair. So, let's get started with the first one. This one is the Sapporo Healthy Vitamin Lemon. Now, a lot of people might not know, but in Japan there are a lot of these vitamin drinks that are just basically lemon drinks with more vitamin C in them. And they decided to make a 5% Chu Chu high with them. Chu high. Chu high with them. It's what is it? Kire Toremon Sefu. And it's got B1, B2, B6, and B12 vitamin. 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 Yeah. Cheers. Oh. Ho ho. <laughs> that is very lemony. It tastes like the vitamin drinks. Yeah. Oh wow, the aftertaste is like tastes like medicine. Yeah. Now <laughs> these vitamin drinks are so you don't get colds during winter mm -hmm. and summer, I guess, because the rainy season. But who? Oh, I don't know who wants to uh, buy a can of that. It's just medication. Medication and alcohol. Hey, it's the perfect salary man drink. Yeah. I'd only have it if I needed to have it though. I wouldn't drink it for fun. Alright, so where are we placing this? In the middle? Your side. I'm not done. No! I'm not drinking the rest of this. In the middle. Fair enough. So we both have to finish it off. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Next time. Next one. It's right. not terrible. It's not terrible. Oh. Uh. <coughs> it's a little, little bit. A little, little bit terrible. terrible. Alright. If you know what Ramune is, it's a little like uh, children's soda drink that you pop the marble down and it goes. Pfft. It's a bastardized name for lemonade. Yeah, it's basically lemonade. But Kieran has uh, this too high drink of strong, nine percent alcohol, and this tastes like Ramune, apparently. Now these strong drinks come in very. Uh, Varying flavors, like you've got lemon, you've got ramune, you've got original dry. But you might be more familiar with the strong zero variant. This is kind of the same product category, but with sugar because there's zero. Oh uh, yeah. Sugar. So these ones are basically sugar. It smells like ramune. Cheers. Oh, I can taste it nine percent. You can also get this one in the big can. As well, mm. it's like a big can about this size, which uh, messes you up. Yeah, one of them's the equivalent of having maybe a couple of shots of vodka. Yeah. <laughs> what, what do you think this tastes like? It's it's like Ramune, but a bit more. Uh, what's the word? It, it's got like syrupy. Syrupy. Yeah, it, it's like Ramune because Ramune I think is quite fresh, refreshing. It's like mm. lemonade, it's like Sprite but nicer. And it kind of just goes straight down, where this one sticks around your mouth a little bit longer. A little bit. I think that's just the essence of the alcohol, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think this one kind of reminds me of, like, 
gin and lemonade. Gin and lemonade? Yeah. It doesn't taste anything like gin. Just a little bit. So, your choice. Do you want it? Yeah. Okay. It's going on my side. <laughs> you had to get the worst. I'll let you take this one. Oh. This is the Asahi Red Eye. This is Asahi, the beer brand. And they came out with a tomato variant. I think it's just regular Asahi beer with 20% tomato, uh, tomato juice. It's weird. All right, it says also on the back that we have to spin it I think two it's to three times. Shake, shake. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> right, Pour it out. What does it look like? Oh, I th I think this is something we shot. All right. Come back. Come back. Three, two, one. Oh. <coughs> oh. So, what does it taste like? It just tastes like tomato juice. There's no alcohol in it whatsoever. I've never had that bad with tomato juice before. <laughs> I think maybe like wheat and tomato juice? Well, that's that's what I think it is, yeah. Oh, that was bad. I don't know if I can drink anymore of that. I, I mean, I, I literally don't know if I can drink any more of that. I think we need a separate pile for that. The we are getting rid of this pile. <laughs> the needs to die pile. Oh, sorry. How dare you? Next up, we have this one. Ah. Mm, so it's one of the cheaper brands of chew high drinks, and it is great. Well, I hope it's great. Either that or they're lying to us. Blueberry. Blueberry. Okay, that's interesting. Mm, blueberry. Yeah. So on, it is. On the blueberry. yeah, on the front it says it's. Jikashi Dori Nihon no no en kara. I was reading the katakana. So on the katakana, it's uh, kanji mote, motegi uh, blueberry. Blueberry. Okay, let's do it then. Okay. I quite like that. Not bad actually. Yeah. It kind of reminds me of the. I don't know if in your part of the world they have this, but in Australia they have like the uh, the tropical juice in the. Oh, yep. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of like guava juice. The, guava, guava juice. Yeah, that's mm. exactly it. Yeah. I quite like that. Yeah, it's not bad actually. Okay. Oh, I'm just gonna let you have it anyway. Ah, Suntory pineapple. So you don't have pineapple on pizza, but you have it in drinks, which is fair enough. Yeah, pineapple is pretty good for a summer drink. Yeah, and it's only three percent, and it's haroe yoi. Yeah, it, it's basically like a summer drink. It, it's got fireworks on it. It's, yeah, I'm gonna presume it just tastes like pineapple. I think so. I think they just put the like, uh, like ice cream pop things on it, so it, you know, accentuates the summerness. Summer. Summer. Okay, let's do this. I like that. Mm, it's just like pineapple. It's like pineapple juice. Yeah. But like not strong. It tastes like wine. What well, doesn't taste like wine? Do you think? I think a little bit. I don't know. I'm not a wine person, so I wouldn't know. But to me, it's like really not as like super duper flavory pineapple juice. Yeah. It's just like a nice, a nice level of like. We I think it'd be definitely good for if you're out at a festival and you just want a drink to cool down. I think the pineapple juice, mm. Suntory drink. Or, or alternatively, if you're on the beachfront and letting your fireworks. Yes. Mm, having some watermelon. Mine. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, we've got the second one of these of the Hiroyoi. Hiroyoi. And I'm. Hiroyoi. Another three percenter. This looks like the watermelon version. Mm. This one's the same company, isn't it? Yeah, the same company, same brand. I think it's the same line of drinks. Yeah. I don't like that. Nope. Nope. It's not terrible. It's not... 
red can of death terrible. <laughs> but it's just it, 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 it tastes like watermelon. I think again, it tastes like watermelon juice or like just normal watermelon. Yeah, but it I'm not sure. Maybe wine? I think it's the same thing with the pineapple, but in this case, it doesn't work for it. It just tastes like weak fruit juice. Yeah, so like the pineapple tastes, you know, like pineapple, mm. but just a weaker version of it, which sort of helps it. And I think the watermelon juice is so weak that it tastes more like just plain alcohol. Mm. I guess that goes into that we both just like a pile. Yeah. Ah. As we were saying before, Strong Zero is one of the other Suntory brands, of which you probably are familiar with, Strong, Strong Zero's Lemon. Mm. I'm not a big fan of the dry ones, personally. I don't mind them. I, I think Strong Zero is definitely my favourite brand of, mm. um, like, chew high drinks. But this one is an apple one. Yeah. 9% apples. I'm, I'm kind of expecting the same kind of flavour as most of the other ones. Like most of these kind of like have their own distinct flavor. So you know they're strong zeros, but with a hint of apple mm. instead of a hint of lemon. Okay. Come back. <laughs> I like that. It just tastes like a candy apple. No, it, it, it's like more of a pearish type flavour, I think. Nah, not pears. It, it tastes like a candy apple with a ton of alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> it's like if you got this like tiny thing and you just like pour it on. Like a, a candy apple, if you left the apple in vodka overnight and then candied it. See, I don't agree. I, I think it tastes more like a pear, a refreshing pear flavour. Nah, a green apple have, has its own like taste to it. Yeah, I don't think it tastes like green apple. I think it tastes a little bit like green apple. I think it's more like a pearish type. I think they're close in family. They are. Yeah. But. <sighs> not sure. No, I, I like that. I'm going to take that. Oh. So, what is that? Is that an apricot or. The image itself, I think, is a recolored apple. Is it? I think so, but I think it's supposed to be like an ap a peach or an apricot. I don't know. I can just try it. Yeah. Oh, I still have the bloody tomato juice flavour first. Just like apple. Apple? Yeah. <laughs> they taste exactly the same. What is the um the strong zero? It tastes similar. Let me look it. I think it tastes similar, but the Strong Zero definitely has a lot more alcohol in it. Yeah. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> it's like alcohol. I think it's the same flavoring they use in both of them, though. Well, it is, it is all Suntory. Mm. But, but this one's just like, oh, we're just going to put like a dab. Yeah, Suntory. It is Suntory. Yeah, yeah they're going to put like a dab in that one of alcohol. This one is just yeah. like, pour it all over. I think this one's like light on alcohol this one's different oh i know what this one is this i picked this one did you know i was good i thought i picked this one calpis sour premium the lemon flavor but it's also got honey on the front of it yeah. it's five percent so it's middle of the road kind of and it's yeah now if you guys aren't aware calpis soda oh wow it's actually got the white milky oh i'm gonna hate this aren't i probably Look at that! So, Kado Pisu, or Cow Piss as I like to call it, is kind of like this soda drink? Would you put it like that? It's like a, like a milky sort of soda it's a, drink? It's like close to like something like a milky Gatorade. Yeah, yeah, it's really nice. I kind of like it. So, this is going to be uh, interesting. Oh, I'm going to have to skull this. this. Okay. Bye. Nasty. It's quite nice. It's got the same kind of like 
of tasty alcohol. But it's got the same kind of like flavour as the drink, a little bit. Mm. It's just a bit more sweeter. It tastes like honey and kelpis, two things I'm not too sold on. I mean, I don't like honey, but I think that's, I think that's quite nice. I'm going to eat this. Cool. Have fun. So this is the grape variant of something. I'm not, I'm not sure if this is, I think it's true higher, because the true higher drinks kind of have this like really vibrant color mm. to them. Oh, it says it's only available from the sixth month to the eighth month. Okay. So it's a limited edition. Yeah. So, limited edition drinks. That's uh, something to clickbait. So yeah, 4% and yeah, it doesn't actually say if it's... Oh yeah, Chew High. So it's another Chew High drink. It's definitely got the great look on it, doesn't it? Yeah. Look at that. It's not quite wine though. It doesn't have like the dark flavour on the wine. It's probably like artificial grape or something. Like Ribena. I definitely don't want this to be Ribena. <laughs> now I definitely do. One problem is, I forgot to uh, do the spinny thing. <laughs> I think it's got some condensation. <laughs> anyway, let's do it! Goodbye. Goodbye. It tastes like Ribena. Yep. That, that, mm. It's Ribena. It's Ribena. <laughs> I don't like Ribena. I think it's not too bad, really. I think drinking the whole thing would be a little bit of a slog, but... I mean, it, it went down nice. really easily. Yeah. Like, super easy. Like, it went like, mm, straight down my throat. Yeah. But it's not too bad. It's not. I think it'll be a little difficult trying to finish the whole thing. But... Well, it's over your side now, so go on back there. So, this is a Kitadin 300% lemon. Kitadin actually has some drinks like Strong Zero. They're basically the same, just different flavor. Like, a little bit different flavor. Mm, I think where Strong Zero is very much alcohol, it's like, mm. this is really strong alcohol that tastes nice. Kieran is like, this is fruit juice with a little bit of alcohol in it, it's pretty nice. But, they're also 9%. Yeah. Yeah, so they kind of fix the taste of the alcohol. Mm. And I, I kind of prefer the Kieran versions. I prefer the Suntory. You know, greatest anime portrayals. But uh, this is a brand new one, 300% lemon, so I thought it would be good to try it. Yeah. Mm. Huh. That's lemon. That's alcohol. That's basically it. And we've got our last drink. Yep. Guess what? It's the third one! Dun, dun, dun. It's the Takara Can Chu Hai butt flavored. One more. Yeah, I don't think there's much to say. It's 3% again, so. I haven't actually tried any peach flavored alcohol. I don't like peaches to begin with, so. It's like really popular in Japan to drink uh, peach flavored drinks with alcohol. In summertime. Mm. It's funny because this is when they released it. Funny. Yeah. About that. Yeah. yeah, it's like they have market research. Ah, <laughs> that is definitely peach flavored. He's cute. Ah, it that. tastes like cuteness. It tastes disgusting. Yeah. It's like if Hello Kitty vomited into a can. <laughs> <laughs> that does not taste good. That does not taste good. I'm sure if the packaging had like you know uh, some Sanrio characters, I would be totally for that. So you're saying you like that? It's not bad actually. That's 12 drinks. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. <laughs> you're like dying, aren't you? I'm not dying. Just warm. All right. Time for uh, part two. Welcome to part two. <laughs> Which isn't another video. It's just a continuation of the same video. Basically, yeah. Yeah. So this is this is the part where we drink. This is the part where we live with our mistakes. Our mistakes. So, we had the great idea during the intermission where from the pile of drinks that we both like and dislike together, we're going to choose the drink the other person will finish. Mm, and as a penalty game, 
any of us that isn't able to finish the drink must finish the Asahi Red. Done, done, done. Done! <sighs> Worst. So, we will rock, paper, scissors, and whoever loses, uh, whoever wins, yep. chooses a drink that the other one must drink. Yep. Okay? So, the idea is either we're very nice to each other, or we're arseholes. Mm. John <laughs> Which one am I drinking? Mm. Apple. Oh. What? Nice. What's that? I think you like you didn't I hate it, so that's cool. Holy shit, you're drinking it fast. Cool. Next. <laughs> that was too Oh shit! <laughs> Alright, what am I drinking? Mm. I'm basically making you drink the ones that I don't want to drink. <laughs> maybe, maybe take a second not to scold the drink. <laughs> it didn't go down my throat! <laughs> Cheat me. Wait, have you done that? No. There's still some in it. God damn it! <laughs> Don't try and cheat me. It wasn't. It wasn't. If I can't finish this one, then I have to drink the red eye. And you definitely won't do that. Stop being so sweet about this bullshit. <laughs> this was a mistake. <laughs> My turn. My turn. <laughs> Not good tasting. Ah, oh. what have we done? Dying a little bit. Let's continue. <laughs> One, two, Damn. take it, <laughs> take it, <laughs> take it. Dead. <laughs> da 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 the video today uh we're gonna drink the rest of the nice ones off screen i'm sure you've enjoyed our pain this one is going to the trash i'll flick it off if it wasn't full <laughs> fuck this drink and if you want to see if you want to see more videos like this please let me know down in the comment section below and also don't forget you can support this channel on patreon what is the patreon 
Patreon is at Dr. Dazza. No! It is patreon.com slash fine I knew it was one. The uh, link is, of course, somewhere on the screen and down in the description down below. Of course, until next time, I've been Dr. Dazza. I've been Kira. Matane. Matane. I'm gonna go die. Okay. Blech.